is up everybody on YouTube, this is Exclusive Kicks coming back with another video and today we're going to continue story time with Jay. So you know, that's our new series, we're going to start story time with Jay. But today we got a special guest, y'all yeah, yeah, probably don't know who he is, you know, he my brother, homie from another mother, you know, every day. Let's get it up for Nick Williams. Yeah! 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 So you know, today we start a new series, Story Time with Jay. And today our story is gonna be about first time we camped out for some shoes, which are the great fives. So let's be um So you know it's a nice summer day. It was around school time ended. And it's about the end. And the great fives was coming out. OG classic classic way, you know, it was nice was this icy. Well I, was, I hit my mom, I was like, Mom, can I get these great five? And she was like, you know, online don't work. And then I was like, well, we can, can Nick can Nick and I camp out. And she was like, uh, I don't really know because, you know, people was getting shot at the time and everything. Because, you know, the Concord came out, what, a year or two earlier. People was getting shot and killed. But, you know, sooner or later, we, we wore her down and she let us camp out. So, you know, we get there around 5 o'clock. My mom just waiting in the parking lot. We at the boulevard. And um, that's in Maryland, PG County, if you don't know. And um, first we go to Foot Locker. But the line is long as crap, so we don't even really go up there. So we go to DTLR, that's across the street, and you know we make some friends. Oh, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me go back. Actually, before we even came, you know we was new, it was our first time, so we got a bag. We was packing snacks, iPad. We was about to watch movies, drinks, you know, blankets. You know, me, it was a little chilly. No, was it chilly? Yeah, because it was early in the morning, it was going to be really cold. So, you know, I came, packed up, sweatshirt and everything. And he come up with some flip-flops, some Adidas pants, and a shirt. Trying to look fresh. But I was like, alright, and when he get there, he freezing his butt off. I was like, that's what you get. And then we going to go back. So, you know, we get back in the DTLR, uh, DTLR line. We like second, third in line. And we like, oh yeah, we get in these drinks, most definitely. And then, um, you know, there was a lady in front of us. She was chill and everything. And um, we wait there for about, what, two hours to get there at five. It's about seven o'clock now. The shoes released at eight. So we bear at seven. You know how the workers, they get there like an hour early. And then he walk up. He's like, how are everybody doing? We're like, good, good. And we was like, just ready to get these great fives. And he like, great fives? We ain't releasing them here. Yeah, I didn't know that. And we like, what? They're they not uh -huh. releasing them here. What are you talking about? He's like, yeah, y'all better go to another line. So everybody get to look at each other. And, you know... Everybody get the booking once one black person runs, the rest of them do. So we started running to another <laughs> line, and you know, another story comes. So I'm gonna let my man Nick take over. Get hey, inside so the story. anyway, anyway, we were 15 spot in line, right? And we were like, now we know we don't have a good chance of getting them, but we still got hope. So, guy came out of a uh, uh, sports zone, and he was like, all right, here's how we're gonna do We're gonna get five people at a time, come in, out, boom, all right, back. Five people come in, done. Five people come in, done. Next thing you know, there's this guy, I swear to you, he was homeless, but he pulled up in some, oh my God, some junkyard car. I don't even know what that was like. <laughs> and something was going. And so he got out the car, he literally ran to the first spot in line, and the guy in Sports Zone came out. He was like, all right, you were here? I don't remember you, but. I be gonna take you anyway. Mm -hmm. Anybody in line was like, something, what? So he got in, got out. Came when when he got out, he was like, hey, I got the great fives. What y'all gonna do now? What y'all gonna do now? And there was this lady in front of me. She was smoking weed. She was like, stinking. Oh, <coughs> stinking. If he was near me, I blow my smoke in front of him. And we started dying. Yeah. But I wish I could say it in a funnier way, but we we just started dying. And so, they went in, uh, people in front of us went in, and came out. So now it was our turn. We came, we went in, and we were like, all right, so, no, they were like, which I, which I, what size I need? And we were like, well, what size I got? And he was like, well, we only got 13 or 14. And we like, you know, uh, okay, we like, try them on. And they're like, what, you, you know you can't fit on no 13 or 14? And we were like, I mean, can we at least try? She's like, nah, get yeah. out. It was like size nine and a half, ten. Yeah, so we stepped out. Dignity was gone. 
Now we saw Foot Locker. Foot Locker line was like OC long. But, you know, we didn't want to leave there with nothing. So we tried Foot Locker. So went in the Foot Locker line. And there was these rumors about some LeBrons coming out. And we like, what LeBron, what LeBron? And guy in front of us, he was like, hey, here's a picture. We like, oh, them joints nice. And it was the LeBron time pure platinum. So I'm like, I'll put a picture up here. I'm gonna put Great Five and then LeBron Ten up in here. And so yeah, he was like, yeah, we, the LeBron Ten's coming up. We like, all right, baby, we should get those if they don't have the Great Five. We wasn't trying to leave without nothing. Yeah, so three hours. Uh, yeah, so you, you got. It. Yeah, so though know, we get in line, we wait for about twenty minutes, and we pull up in front of the line. We like, all right, please have some Great Fives. The girl they like, oh no, we sat out there like hours to go you know how Foot Locker and them they like they do behind back doors they be getting to like their co-workers they get first serve and everything that was back in the day when like you used to pull up to the store and they only had like five in stock like what but we get up there they like all right she's like but we got the LeBron 10s though we was like okay we might as well because we ain't trying to leave with nothing and my mom was probably gonna kill me if we came with nothing so we put our names on the list she's like all right go in and um, we walk in, we nervous and everything, because it was our first time. And we pull up to the casualist, and he's like, what y'all need? LeBron 10, size 10. He's like, all right, I got y'all. Because back then, LeBron 10 box was like, boom, was huge. He put them on the table, he opened them, it was like, oh! <laughs> and this was like, this icy. was icy, and it had that new shoe smell. So we both bought a pair, and then my mom, she come walking in. You know how moms are. She got to take a picture. I didn't take a picture of y'all. It was embarrassing. And we like, come on now, cause you know you got they, you got the OG heads in line, the professionals. They there, they've been doing this for years. We look like some newbies, and we was like, dang, okay, whatever. So then we did that. We get it. We walk out, and then my mom, we get in the car, and then you wanna finish the rest of the story? Y'all? Oh yeah, yeah. Right, so like, there was this guy. He had like a big afro. He looked like, oh my god. He was, he was mixed. He's like what Hispanic? Nah, he looked like I can't remember the the music or songs, but. Oh my god, he looked like this guy who used to, he was a big guy who made music. But anyways, he had big, he has this big afro, some fat glasses, and he had uh, KD4 on pearls. And he was like the main guy talking about how, oh yeah, I'm going to get some shoe, I'm going to get these great fives, I'm going to get these Le uh, LeBrons. We're like, yeah, okay. We rolled down, this is, I'll never forget this. We went by him, we rolled down the window, and we like, hey, look what we got. And he's like... And we were like, oh, no, nah, but yeah. yeah, then we just pulled off. That was pretty much it. You know, first time camping out the story. We hope y'all enjoyed it. After that, my mom was like, oh, yeah, y'all buy me some breakfast. Wake me up at 5 o'clock in the morning. That was the least we can do. So, yeah, we went on and did that and everything. But uh, story time with Jay. We're going to have more stories coming. Um... Nick, you know how it goes. Please Nick, right? like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, we're trying to get to 100 subscribers by school time start. I believe not August 27th, it's like the 25th, something like that. Uh, 100 subscribers, you know, follow him on Twitter at exclusive Nick. You know how that go. I put it down below. Uh, you know what's good. And Wait, dude. Let's go. Hey.